First of all, when and how did you get into amateur radio? Was in Argentina, uh, in high school. A good friend of mine was part of, um, let's say, Boy Scout group, and he introduced me to the radio. He was playing and making some contact with this VHF uh, two meters radio. Uh, well. After that, I said, oh, I like this. Uh, I start with uh, taking the, the course in, in, in Argentina, in the radio club. That is where everything started. What excites you most about your hobby? Well, I love to make QRP contacts uh, on the field. It is something that I really enjoy. And also to test new antennas and yes, uh, also to do it by myself, try different antennas and all, I will say that 90% of the time I work with QRP uh, radios and try to make a lot of contact uh, as I can. And also I have a remote station in Argentina that I uh, use quite often also. Uh, because here in Europe it's a little bit complicated to have uh, enough space to put um, nice antennas uh, so that my solution is to put everything <laughs> to make my setup in Argentina. What are the different possibilities to practice amateur radio and which of them do you enjoy the most? Well, uh, as I said before, I really enjoy to make QRP uh, contacts uh, on go to the field and from there the reception is amazing. I really love having sometimes S0 on my S meter and I start to think, is my radio working okay? <laughs> because <laughs> in some noisy bands, when you go just a little bit outside of the city, you uh, reach S1 or S2 uh, units of, uh, of ground noise. And, and wow, this is amazing to reception and of course to make contact. This is something that I love and I really, really like to do QRP contacts uh, outside in the field uh, and also make some sota, uh, pota, whatever I can. What tips can you give to newcomers and those returning to the hobby of amateur radio to either start from scratch or get back into it easily and without too much effort? My recommendation is to be curious. Uh, today we have tons of, um, of material on internet, YouTube, blogs, etc. where you can read and learn how to get started in, in ham radio hobbies. Uh, also Wimo have uh, an, a special web page, it's called Discover, where you can go there and read and learn how to start with the ham radio, what is going on, uh, etc. So it's really, really good. Today there are tons of uh, articles and information everywhere in internet where you can read. You just need to be curious. And also for the people that is a long time, they are not uh, on the hobby. Uh, in, I would say that in the last 10 years there have been a lot of innovations. Uh, this, the same recommendation is also to be curious. Came back to, to radio, start turn on your radio, take the dust the <laughs> from, from your old radio if you have one and, and start just put a cable and listen what is going on. You will, the, the spark will be again. Uh, that's that's our my, my recommendation. Many thanks Ivan. Bye bye, thanks.